Okay, got a five-point win here at home to Penzance into the quarterfinals of the Senior Cup. Yep. What do you make of the game? Oh, it's a tough, tough game. We've got a local derby for us. The conditions aren't great. Really boggy underfoot. But it's a hard-working performance, I think, from us. We took our chances well. Jordi, Marcelo, three, uh, ran them ragged at the back. And overall, we're delighted to get into the quarterfinals. Yeah, not a lot of the games elsewhere in the county all get called off. This one of the ones the games to stay on. Good weather to play it at the end. We're just happy just to get it on now rather than having to have it drag on. Yeah, I think they were trying to, if it wasn't on today, I think it was going to be Wednesday. But credit to the ground staff. They've managed to get us on when not a lot, uh, like you said, not a lot of uh, other games are on. Uh, so yeah, we're delighted to get a win, get a three point, well not three points, get into the next <laughs> round of the cup and uh, hopefully progress from that. Yeah, uh, 50 minutes, is another goal early on yep. for the team, James Ward scored a good finish, it's uh, got a knack really of getting that early goal starting strong. And we see, yeah, we seem to, I think the stats have shown we uh, score quite early on and we score quite late on and then we have a little sticky patch maybe or where we just try and control the game in the middle. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a credit to how we train, how we warm up, how we prepare, that we can get in there, have an early start and push on from that. Yeah. Uh, 2 0 through Marcello, and then uh, Fenzans had a bit of time where they were putting some pressure on you, but then you get go in and get that third goal. How crucial is that to get that goal when they're under a bit of pressure? And not only under pressure, just before half time as well. I think it was crucial yeah. they started getting their tails up a little bit, thought they might be able to get back in that. I think our third goal sealed the game, really. But they did get that goal four minutes or so into the second half um, could that possibly have been a bit of a game changer in a way uh, I think they, yeah they could have put pressure on then I think if their tails got up and they proper started going at us I think we controlled the game even though I haven't conceded I think we still controlled the game predominantly so it's a good performance yeah. get the goal was it no, it was 4-1, 4-1 and then um, Jordan had a chance to make the hat trick uh, we threw on goal bit of a, a dodgy tackle end up giving a yellow card for it but there were certainly calls where it could certainly have been more than that I think what's the your referee view was the only person on that pitch that thought that was a yellow card I think anyone else referee in that game would have given that as a red clean through and goal no one's catching Jordy I think he's got away with one there Jordan Lynch comes off uh, and a couple of subs come on and Ollie Walker one of those subs makes, makes the fifth goal good cross to uh, Martello to make it five and it shows how much uh, strength and depth we've got in this. We made a couple of changes today, still had different people on the bench, they've come on, they've made an impact. I think it just bodes well for how our team is, how our team spirit, and it should be a good season, the rest of the season. Yeah, yeah four, of the, four of the five goals came from that front two again, uh, two of them, two, two, two each. Uh, Martello's now got nine cup goals this season in the Cups alone, and Jordan's now on 26 in total. Yeah. They're both having a fantastic season, aren't they? You can't. <laughs> can't pick any faults in the pair of them. They, they, they link up so well as well. I think if you actually look at it, the amount of times they've probably assisted each other as well is incredible. They're both... You know what, it's my first season here, but I've, I haven't seen a better duo or played with a better duo up front than them, so they're on absolute fire. Of course, with the Water Sea Pass and Cup, that's now two core finals to look forward to. Very good chance of getting some silverware this season. Hopefully. Just keep taking each game as it comes. That's league and both cups. And hopefully get some silverware and get ourselves in the final and get a day out.